some of the quests make you work for it. The one, the one that I did before this, uh, I'm doing the the Neverine, the prophecy stuff, and I got to the village out in the middle of nowhere. You know, you, you talk to everybody and everybody hates you. Like 13 out of 100 person uh, friendship or whatever. And I finally found one one resident who wanted me to get him roots. <laughs> Everybody else, everybody's like, yeah, give me some gold. And I, you know, saved my game, gave some gold, and they became friendly, but they're like, whatever. We ain't gonna tell you shit. So, it's, 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 I like it. I like the way that this quest, like, it's, this is fun. Um, you know, compared to, you know, Dragon's Dogma, which I just played through. The first part, there's still more Dragon's Dogma. Like, there's the New Game Plus stuff and Black, uh, Bitter Black Isle, but some of the quests that they would send you on are just, were just like, mind-numbing. But, you know, I, this is handled a bit better. It's, you know, you kind of have to... The dialogue trees can get it pretty ridiculous. Um, I'm glad they went away from that. Um, I like the amount of detail and the amount of stuff you can talk about. That's kind of nice. I, I think I, I probably missed that, just because of the amount of lore and things they, they cram in here. It does make for a lot of reading, but... All in all, it's been a it's been a more positive than negative experience, like way more positive. I'm really enjoying it. I'm glad that I'm playing through. The, I actually, I actually, uh, when I finish this, um, I play through the DLC. But I, I do want to play Oblivion as well. So I'm going to download. I've already got down, Oblivion downloaded again. Um, read all my save games, um, and I'll play through it. Play through that properly. Well, I played a bit, a lot more Oblivion, but didn't really make a whole lot of headway on the single player mission. I don't think. Um, I can't remember much of what I did anyway. So, I do want to play through Oblivion as well after this. Oh, there some nice little scrolling. Copy of based dialogue options do get annoying. NPCs could have more personality. Yeah, at least they give you the option that they put the uh, highlighted words in the paragraphs so you can kind of go right through it. Actually, the, the woman, the wise woman, gave me the option. She's like, I can tell you about these four different things, or five different elements, like the sixth house, and the, and the prophecies and everything, or you can just ask me if you if you pass or not. <laughs> like, are you, or yes? Yes or no? And I'm like, well, I want to know all the things, so, you know, ask all the questions. But they gave me the option just kind of like, well, if you wanted to skip ahead and not listen to me ramble, you can totally do that too. And I like this, I like this hammer, but that weight is brutal. Eleven more damage. It's not worth it. Maybe I can carry it out of here. But seventy-five weight. That's ah, good. Oh no, I can't. The 75 weight though, that just that's 11, 11 more damage for the night, you know, my weight carrying shit is kind of crucial. I'm trying desperately to, to, to work on my uh, two-handed, my blood skill. It's only, only at 33. Um, but I did find in the, finding the, the bow, the bow for the tribe leader so then I could so doing that first then, so then I could talk to the woman the wise woman I found the mage bane a mage bane a steel shard slayer down in the in those burial chambers so I also found um Glass boots that weigh way less than these Dora ones. I'm missing out seven armor rating, but the weight is fifteen less. Oh, my armor doesn't change. Oh, that's pretty awesome. Oh, but wait, is it light armor? Isn't it? Damn, it's light armor. Sell it. A bunch of money. 
Nagoth cares. He is dead. Well, my uh, my long blade is up to seventy. So, if my if the dwarven warhammer isn't doing much damage, then I just I just swap over and just wreck everything like this fire edge duck. Turn the did you just turn off because I came over. Okay. Put the uh, put the old mage bane on. Wreck shit. I found a good one-handed hammer, or one-handed sword, but I'm really enjoying, like, this, this two-handed stuff is just dropping shit like no one's business. But I'm definitely glad the, um, the major heart. Definitely glad the, uh, weapons share the same, the same stat, so long, long blades, or long, uh, was it? No. Long blades work on two-handed blades and single. Man, if it was if it was like two-handed and one-handed, oh, that would be brutal. Really Weapon level is mostly about the chance to hit. I don't think it actually face damage at all. Yeah, I'd like to get up to 50. 70? Like, long blade at 70? 70, 70 points just seems to hit everything. Like, I just, the answer knock, I just put the, the two-handed away, the blunt, pull out the, the sword, and just, just whack the shit out of it. Whack the shit out of it. The level is mostly about chance to hit, and I don't think it actually affects damage at all. No, I think you're, I, you're probably right. It, well, does it even say? Long blade skill lets one use broadsword, sabers, longsword, slamwords, katanas, and katanas. Mentally. Governing attribute strength. Blunt is also strength. Yeah, I think the strength is what does the damage. Affects your starting health, how much you can carry, your maximum fatigue, and how much damage you do with a melee. Yeah. It's strange that it doesn't say that. I mean, it could say how proficient you are with long blades. Like, allows you to use them and how... Hey, wait. How, how to use them? How to use them? No. It doesn't really say that. It's, it, it feels that way. That's what I get out of it. Yeah. Strength is damage, and then... Um, go. Mr. Bones. These guys are nothing. One. Hit. Boink. Hello. That adventure. Dire flame blade. Sharp blade. Eh. Demon lock pick. Probe. Gold. Body still fresh. I need to find a better night eye spell. Twenty points isn't doing shit. I thought I was doing a lot. I thought it was, I thought it was actually doing pretty well, but coming here and I because I don't want to have to use a torch. Hello. <laughs> Those guys, yeah, because they cast magic. So I really should go out those guys with with blade weapons, but what is the fun in that? Oh, there you are. Oh, <gasps> oh. Level up! 34. Oh, you don't look good. What are you? Oh, no, no, no. 
That was a hard one. Quick save. Hoi! Oh shit! That's all my god! Wow! I hit with every shot? That's madness. What's that? Dwarven war axe. What? They do not. Eat it. One handed, 124. Value 450. Weight 24. Does he have like red hair? <laughs> okay. Got that TV presenter. Can't remember his name though. Wow. Danger. That went. Oh, don't be. Is, are you a. Drag your balls over here. Err. Come on. Urgh. Oh, I watched it. Right. Long blade skilled 71. Alright. There, can I rest now, please? For the love of. Quick save. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna need. I, I haven't been put into a situation where I just got completely wrecked from magic, but it's gonna happen. These guys, these guys are, are good. I don't come across these guys that often, but they're an ex excellent example of why I need, a, like, resist magic, like something awful. Uh, strength, intelligence again. Gee, maybe I'll do willpower. I do an endurance though. Endurance is going to be going all the way up. But determines your maximum amount of magicka. I think I got to do some willpower though for a chance to hit. Maximum fatigue, ability to use resist, effective ability to resist magic, and your maximum fatigue. Hmm. Agility doesn't go up. Affects your ability to dodge and hit targets in melee as well as your maximum fatigue. I've already come across, I think, one situation. Well, no, wait, was it one? Do I have enough magic to cast anything? I think the problem the problem is more being able to cast it, having the high enough ability. I don't think having enough mana is the actual problem, per se. Except for the spells that I can't actually cast because it's something where I fail, like Recall. Resist magic and her maximum fatigue. F5. 73 strength. Love it. If I get five more? Five more strength? Oh no, it's two. Oh, well, it tells me what I mean. Yeah. Yeah, it's that's it's it's true, yeah. That's actually, that's actually why I made I made this one. Uh P Telly. Practice tele practice uh telekinesis for mysticism. I need to go I need to make one I wish I could make one for conjuring. Conjuration is really bad, I think for me. Yeah, conjuration is six seventeen. I probably will have to end up just using Items that can summon monster or summon anim summon things for me. I don't have to worry about casting it myself. The restoration, though, what's restoration at? Restoration. Ah, restoration is one of my major skills. That's good. Yeah. You have a recommendation for a practice restoration skill? 